Batesville College is the first school in Arkansas to announce all classes will be online this semester. THV 11's Mercedes McKay spoke with Lyon College administration and students about why they believe this is the right move. It's really a difficult decision, but I think ultimately we wanted to make it for ourselves instead of having it made for us. A decision that Lyon College President Joseph King says didn't come easy. What you're really weighing is your students' health and wel welfare against you know, their desire and our desire, frankly, for them to be in residence on campus, to have a, you know, access to social events, to you know, participate in athletics. The Board of Trustees voting unanimously to be fully remote for fall 2020 and cancel all sports. We spent all summer trying to figure out how to do this in person. And, you know, we really, I think, explored every option. Administration putting all the factors together, including where their students come from, the close quarters of the residence halls, the availability of testing on a timely basis, and their location as an institution. If we had an outbreak, that spread you know, across campus or worse, you know, all over town, uh, you know, that was another consideration is just even the access to healthcare facilities that we might need. Student services like counseling, health and wellness and academic support will still be offered and has even expanded since last semester. The college is also giving a grant to each student to acknowledge their resilience, which will reduce each student's remaining balance for their fall tuition by 15%. We know that our students need aid from us that goes far beyond the classroom, and, and we're, we're there and ready to provide it. Senior Allison Mundy describes it as bittersweet. In a perfect world, like I never want this to happen, but I also understand why, and I respect it even though it's not what I want to be for my senior year. Not being able to experience her favorite parts of Lyon and Batesville with her friends is what is hitting Monday the hardest. But she's remaining optimistic and is glad to be a part of a university that cares about her safety. The whole situation is very sad and as much as we all wish to change it, we're all doing the best with what we got. So trying to make it through. In Little Rock, Mercedes McKay, THV 11 News.